Hello, good evening, everyone. How are you tonight? Hello. Hi, how are you? Good evening. It's a pleasure to be with you tonight. Uh, thanks a lot for your punctuality, right? Uh, you are doing a very good job in this course. So thank you very much. Uh, do you remember, do you remember, sorry, do you remember yesterday's topic? Do you remember yesterday's topic? What did we study yesterday? No, do you remember what was the topic yesterday? What was yesterday topic? We studied giving direction. Do you remember some expression to give direction in English? No, guys, can you listen to me? Yes, I listen. I, yesterday, I don't care connect. Ah, you weren't in the class yesterday. Okay, yeah. I'm so sorry. Tonight, we're going to have a feedback of the meter and test. It is supposed that you have already taken this. Uh, can you hizo el examen de medio curso, the meter? Ya lo realizaron? ¿En qué sección de la plataforma están trabajando? Can you tell me? I didn't finish this, this question. Uh, okay, you have already finished the midterm. ¿Ya realizaron yep. el midterm? Hello, Morena. Hello, Alexis, Hello. Mario, Jonathan, Felipe. Welcome to the class. Uh, Hello. Okay. Good, good, evening. good evening. Hello, good evening. How are you? How are you tonight? I'm fine. Oh, you're fine, okay. I'm fine. Jonathan is fine too, very good. And we are talking about the midterm exam. Quien ya lo hizo? Quien ya realizó este examen? Okay, Alexis todavía no. Morena, what about you? Yeah. Yes, okay, Felipe. Let me finish the story. Yes, uh, Jonathan and Mario. Yes, finish. You finished the oh, Okay, very good job. So, so you are doing good. Thank you. So it was it easy or it was difficult? Was it easy or was it difficult? ¿Cómo sintieron el midterm? For me, it's more easy. Easy. It's more, it's, it's more easy. For, oh. I have problem what what you I can I don't care right. It's it's more problem for me. Okay, so you say it was easy for you. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Very good. Alpha. What about you? Did you finish the meter exam? Or not yet? No teacher. No yet. Tomorrow. Ah, it's okay. Don't worry. You can do it that tomorrow. Very good. Tomorrow. Tomorrow, perfect. So tonight we're going to have a feedback of the midterm or a review right, of the topic that you found in the midterm. So let's start with tonight's class and we're going to start with that, right? Midterm exam feedback. But before to go to the topic, uh, I want to know if you remember some expression that we use to give direction to people. Do you remember that? We studied that yesterday, giving direction. Do you remember some phrases? For example, si usted quiere que la persona se vaya recto en esa calle, ¿cómo decimos eso? What is the expression we use to help people? Mm, recto, derecho. 
You say, vaya recto. Oh, you don't remember. Don't worry. So it's go up. Go. You can say, go up. Go up. Yeah. You walk, walk up. You can say, go strike. Go strike. Go strike. And also you can use go along. Go along. Go try on. Y si quiero decir, gire a la izquierda. Gire to left on. Okay, very good. Turn, turn left turn on. Turn left on. And what about if I want to say, gire a la derecha. Vaya turn a la left. derecha. Turn, turn, turn right. right. On. Okay, excellent. Turn right on. Very good. Y si quiero decir el edificio está en medio de, ¿cuál preposición vamos a utilizar? En medio de. En medio de. What is between, that preposition? Between. Okay, excellent. Between. 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 Excellent. Entre. Y si el edificio have, que estamos buscando. Teacher. Tell me, what is your Good question? Good evening, everybody. I'm okay. sorry to be late. Uh, don't worry about that, Walter. Welcome to the class. And what is your question? Thank you. What is the difference when you say turn left or um, turn mega left? Mega left. Mm. People in America say mega left or mega right. No, mm. say turn left or turn right. Yeah. What, what is, is the expression? You say uh, make a left. left, make a left, make a left. I haven't yes. heard that expression. The people, people black, say this. Uh, do you have any? Do you have any idea how to write this? Yeah, well, I I driving with the people say me, uh, you can make a left in two blocks, make a left. Or uh, next, you uh, right. You really? what this, but what is? I don't know what is. What is the difference? Okay, probably it's in a for an informal way to say this direction. Okay. But I'm going to look for a dots expression um, that you want to tell him tonight, and we're going to discuss that later. So you say, turn left. In informal way. Make a left. Informal, give me a second. I'm looking for that. So let's see. I can find that sound, but I'm going to investigate, right? I'm going to investigate and tomorrow, oh, sorry, on uh, Monday, we're going to discuss those sounds. Okay, thank Do you, you agree? Okay, thank you for your question. Ya me dejo tarea. We're going to investigate. Good that. evening. Hello, Excuse good evening. Me. Good evening. Hello, is it uh, Felipe? Send it by the WhatsApp. Hola. The world mega left. Yeah, look for WhatsApp. Come. Oh, right. how, uh, how do I you write this? When you, when you drive, you see mega left, the people say mega left, mega right. Okay, I'm going to investigate. Okay, you can share that on WhatsApp. If it is a video, right? if it is a video, you can send the link and we're going to watch it, right? And we're going to learn about those sounds. Right. Thank, thank you very much. Now let's continue with the class. What about if the building that we are looking for is atrás de? What is the preposition? Behind. Behind. Okay, excellent. And what about if it is the place we are looking for is a la par de? Next. 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 Next to. Okay, we say next to. Next to. On the left. On the left. Yes. Okay, you say on the left. Okay, very good. On the left. On the left. On the right. On the right. You are learning very fast. I like that. Very good. 
Very good. So on the left and the right. Yeah, it sounds good. pretty, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. So I can see that you remember some of this expression, right? So very good. Uh, let's start with tonight's class. I'm going to share with you the presentation of tonight. And is this. Uh, let me know, please, if you can see my screen. I'm sharing it with you. Yes, teacher. We are yeah. looking at it. Okay, excellent. So let me hide this and this. Feedback. We are going to start. It is supposed that you have already taken the meter sum, right? Is that correct? Que ya hicieron el examen de medio curso. I am, yeah. uh, I know that's another yeah, sure. thing. That. I finished. Hey. Qué pena, teacher, yo no he tenido tiempo. Okay, don't worry, don't worry. El feedback de hoy le va a ayudar, ¿verdad? Eh, para que lo resuelva más rápido. So, welcome to your este class. Este fin de no... semana me comprometo con todo, ponerme al día. Okay, okay, thank you. Very good. So, let's see. We are going to listen the following conversation. Eh, it is about going to, right? Can you find some sentences in which going to is used in this conversation? And tell me which are they. Going to, do you remember that? Yes, sir. Sure. Which one? Which are some sentences? Tell me. So the first one, yeah. the first one is a sentence using going to, and it is a question. Are you going to yeah. do anything special yeah. this weekend, Julie? Always home. And the other example is, how old is he going to be? It's another question, right? How old is he going to be? He is going to be 13. It's another expression using going to. And he is going to go on a high school next year. It's another example. Now let's see here. Uh, which is the other sound for going to? The informal sound? What is it? Do you remember that? Gonna. Gonna. Okay. Gonna. Thank gonna. you, Cidro. Gonna. You are right. Gonna is the sound. So we are going to listen to this small conversation. But in a second. I forgot to choose this option here. Share sound with you. Say share audio. So here we go. I'm pretty sure that you are going to listen now. Just give me a second. Let me know if you can listen. One. Listen, teacher. Okay, what was the number? One. 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 <laughs> no, okay, okay, pretty good. So, here we go. Here we go. So listen. One. Are you going to do anything special this weekend, Julie? Well, it's Mark's birthday. Oh, great. How old is he going to be? He's going to be 13. 13? He's growing up. Yes. He's going to go to high school next year. Okay. Listen again, pay attention to the pronunciation because you are going to practice after the listening part. All right. So, ready? Are you ready? Yes. Yeah, do it. Ready. Let's do it. I'm ready. ready we are ready. Ready. Okay. Pay attention to the pronunciation, please. One. Are you going to do anything special this weekend, Julie? Well, it's Mark's birthday. Oh, great. How old is he going to be? He's going to be 13. 13? He's growing up. Yes. He's going to go to high school next year. Okay. Now I need two volunteers to practice this small conversation. Who wants to practice tonight? Let me know, please, if you want to practice. No, you can do it. I'm sure that you can do it. I got it. Okay. Thank you, Felipe. Felipe and... Any other volunteer tonight? 
It's, ta it's time for you to practice. Who say me? Me. me. Ah, okay. Thank yeah. you, Al. Thank you, Alpha. <laughs> uh, can you please start, Felipe? Okay. Are you going to do anything special this weekend, Julie? Well, it's my birthday. Oh, great. How old is, is he going to be? He's going to be 13. 13. He is gro growing up. Yes. He's going to go on a high school high next high year. School next Excellent job. Thank you very much. But listen again and try to imitate, try to imitate the pronunciation and the intonation. So, all right. okay. First of all, the sound is not going to. In the conversation, we heard gonna, gonna, right? So listen again. Let's start. One. Are you going to do anything special this weekend, Julie? Well, it's Mark's birthday. Oh, great. How old is he going to be? He's going to be 13. 13? He's growing up. Yes. He's going to go to high school next year. Two. Okay. Let's All right. Try it. Let's try it again. Can you please yeah. Felipe and Alpha? All right. Okay. Let's do it again. Are going, Bernard. are going to do anything special this weekend, Julie? Well, it's my birthday. Oh, great. How old is he going to be? He's going to 13. 13. He's growing up. Yes, he's going to, to go on high school Go on. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, thank you. That was <laughs> pretty much good. Better. Much better. Next, That's next. That was excellent. <laughs> I, yeah. I need other two volunteers to practice this conversation. Thank you, Felipe. Thank you, Alfa. You did thank you. Job. Ahí vamos. Vamos thank you. Thank you. La lengüita. Yeah, you are doing that. Uh, any volunteer? Any other okay. volunteer? I want to try it. Okay, thank you, Isidro. And Anyone? My. Thank you, Alexis. Thank you, Alexis. Yeah, you can start, Isidro. Okay. Oh, just let me do this. Oh, excuse me, just let me. All right. Ready? Are you going to do anything special this weekend, June? Julie? Well, it's Mark birthday. Oh, great. How, how old is going to be? He is going to be 13. 13. He's growing up. Yes, he is going to go on a high school next year. Excellent job. Very good. That was very good. Very good. Hey! <laughs> so, hey! He's going to be 13. He's going to be 13. Next. 13. So <laughs> the expression at 13 is 13. 13. 13. 13. 13. 13. 13. He's growing 13. up. He's growing up. 13. Yes. He's going to go on a high school next year. So it is, it's, like, it's like a surprise, right? 13. He's growing up. Yeah. Also, yeah. when you have, oh, great. Oh, great. How old is going to be? Oh, great. 13. <laughs> 13. Right? He's growing up. Are you going to do anything going special this weekend, Julie? Ah. Well, it's my. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go with the next. Let's go with the next small conversation. One. The people is on fire. Special this week. Oh, that is the person. Let's go with this. This is the second conversation. And we're going to listen it again. So it says, so what are you going to do for his birthday? What are you going to do for his birthday? We are going to have a party for him. Terrific. When are you going to have it? Well, his birthday is on Friday. 
but we are going we are gonna have the party on the weekend on saturday or sunday on sunday everybody can come that day on sunday everybody can come that day so when is the birthday when is his birthday on saturday and not really on sunday on sunday <laughs> No, it isn't on Sunday. When is his birthday? When is when Saturday? Is party, party on the weekend. The party is going to be on the weekend, but his birthday is on. All right, yes, yes. Friday. Friday. It's Saturday. It's, Friday. it's on Friday. It's on Friday. So listen to the conversation. We are going to start. Es que no he tomado este fin de semana. Estoy seco. <laughs> That's oh, okay. That's why. That's why. <laughs> no hay chola. Ah. <laughs> One. Are you going to do special this weekend, Julie? Really? <laughs> okay, listen to this conversation. Two. So, what are you going to do for his birthday? We're going to have a party for him. Terrific. When are you going to have it? Well, his birthday is on Friday. But we're going to have the party on the weekend. On Saturday or Sunday? On Saturday. Everybody can come that day. Okay. Three. Listen Saturday. again. What kind of party are you going to have? Two. Pay attention to the pronunciation and also the intonation, which is terrific. When terrific. You, okay, terrific, right? So. Sure, terrific. Yeah, terrific. Well, <laughs> so what are you going to do for his birthday? We're going to have a party for him. Terrific. When are you going to have it? Well, his birthday is on Friday, but we're going to have the party on the weekend. On Saturday or Sunday? On Saturday. Everybody can come that day. Okay. Any to volunteer to practice in this small conversation? Who wants to try it? Right. In the last part. Uh, question. The, the record say Saturday and he see Sunday. Yes. Uh -huh. okay. yes. Okay. It's Let's... a little mistake. I... Sí. Oh, you yes. say in the last sentence? Okay, yes, we're, going to, we're, we're going to fix that in a second. Alexis, what is your question? Eh, lo mismo le iba a decir, teacher. Ah, okay. Que dice Saturday y abajo dice Sunday. Ah, ok. Oh, okay. Y me gustaría decirles que fue un error intencional para que ustedes lo descubrieran, pero but it's not true. <laughs> <laughs> we, are, we, are in, we are in la jugada. Yes, so, you are. What are you going to do for his birthday? We're going to have a party for him. Let me listen. Terrific. Let me listen. When are you going to have it? Well, his birthday is on Friday, but we're going to have the party on the weekend. On Saturday or Sunday? On Saturday, everybody can come that day. Okay, very good. Yes, it says on Saturday. So we are going to fix it in a moment. Is the second one? It's here on Saturday. Very good. Okay, very good. Very good job. So I need to volunteer to practice this small conversation. So who wants to practice? Anyone the in teacher. here? Thank you, Walter and the teacher. Jonathan. Thank you, Jonathan. So, Jonathan, can you please start? And then, Walter. Here we go. So, so what are you going to for his for his birthday? We are going to have a party for him. Terrific. When are you going to have it? Well, his birthday is on Friday, but we are going to have to party on the weekend. On Saturday or on Sunday? On Saturday. Everybody can come that day. Excellent. That was almost perfect. Very good pronunciation. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you, Walter, Walter and Jonathan. Thank you. Let's listen um, to two classmates. Any volunteer? Any volunteer? 
Thank you, Morena. Thank you very much. And, <laughs> and, <laughs> and Alba, excellent. Thank you, Alba. <laughs> Thank you. So let's listen, Morena so, and Alba. Morena, okay. can you please start? Okay. So, so what are you go, gonna do for his birthday? Yo empiezo. Yes, yes. Alba, can you so, continue? Mm -hmm. Oh no. Oh, no. Children. Hello, Alba, can you help us with this? <laughs> the baby is going to say it. Okay. I guess that she's oh, busy. Right? Sleeping. Okay, I'm so sorry. Um, it seems that she's sleeping. Mario Renato, can you help? Can you help me with this part? With Morena, please. Can you, okay. Mario? Okay. Okay. Okay, okay Morena. Empiezo. Can, you, can you please Bye. start again, please? Okay. Thank so, you very much. what are you go, going to do for his birthday? We are, we are going to have a party for him. There it. Where are you going to, to head it? Well, his, his birthday is on Friday, but we are going to have the party in the weekend. On Saturday or Sunday? On um, Saturday. Everybody can come that day. Thank you. That was excellent. Very good. Just this word, how do you pronounce this? Can you help me, please? Terrific. 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 How do you pronounce this? Gracias, Isidro. <laughs> Terrific. Yeah, but, 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 thank you, but, but, but. 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 Okay, Thank very you. good. You are doing a great job in this part. I have a third conversation for you tonight. So we're going to listen. One. All right. Okay, here is the third one. So Same. what kind of party are you going to have? Oh, well, we are going to have a karaoke party. A what? Do you know my karaoke? What? People stand up and sing songs. The music is on a CD and the words are on the television. I see. So Mark likes karaoke. He loves it. So listen. Let's Pretty listen good. The conversation. Otra vez. Yeah. Again. <laughs> okay. Yes, a second. Let's do it. Here we are. It's in the second 40. We're going to look for it. 40, 40, 40, 40. It's here. So listen. Three. What kind of party are you going to have? Oh, well, we're going to have a karaoke party. A what? You know, karaoke. People stand up and sing songs. The music is on a CD, and the words are on television. I see. So Mark likes karaoke? He loves it. Okay. Really good. Karaoke. 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 Do you like karaoke? karaoke. I really like karaoke. Yes, I like it. I like it. Sing. I like it. Ah, every, everybody likes to sing. I like it. Sing. What is what is your favorite song to sing in a karaoke? What? Salsa music. Agropecuaria music, the banda. <laughs> okay. Okay, very good. Desde ayer está igual. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, listen again. Listen again. Pay attention to the pronunciation. Let's do it. And intonation. Why? Of our different teams, right? Pronunciation is the way you pronounce every single word. And intonation is cuando le damos emoción, ¿verdad? All right. Emoción, right? So if it is a question, you say, what kind of party are you going to have? Okay. So uh, question, right? Okay. Uh, oh, well, right? Surprise, right? Oh, well, so we're going to have a karaoke party. It's a what? What? A what? So a question. Karaoke? Teacher. Yes? Uh, I'm partnered. Uh, I think uh, so. We 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 need to have a little an actor like this, an actor like an actor. Oh yeah, right. Um, you have maybe to be, some. 
maybe some move, uh, corporal move, no sé, movimientos it's corporales. Oh, uh, uh, what? In the world are. <laughs> well, let's listen, Morena. She is okay, no, no, no. <laughs> Morena is on fire. fire. <laughs> <laughs> it's practice a lot. So, uh, yes, right. Um, English is the same as in Spanish, right? Y cuando usted le está contando la novela a su comadre, usted hace gestos, usted mueve wow. sus manos. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Y le dice, fíjate, ¿verdad? Ay, fíjate. Yes, yes. <risa> Amigos, sí. teacher, pero yo creo, a mí realmente me encanta mucho escuchar las, las conversations. I really like to, to hear the conversation because of, eh, that's the only way you can eh, pronounce, you, you learn to, 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 uh. to pronounce the word. Okay, thank you very much. So let's listen again this, and then we're going to have the practice. Okay. Here we go. Listen. Three. What kind of party are you going to have? Oh, well, we're going to have a karaoke party. A what? You know, karaoke. People stand up and sing songs. The music is on a CD and the words are on television. I see. So Mark likes karaoke? He loves it. He loves it. Lo Okay, in this conversation, there is a mistake too, right? Really? What is, what is the mistake? <laughs> what is the mistake? I will own you a chocolate if you find the mistake. But before to... Okay, do... okay, okay. I think I, fi I find it. Okay, tell me I what see, you said. I, I see. So Mark likes. Oh yes, the S. No so Mark likes. So Mark likes karaoke. So Mark likes karaoke. Very good, Isidro. I owe you a chocolate. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm going to send you <laughs> at the post Thank office. You. Right? Un chocolate virtual. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay, a yes, ritual, right? chocolate. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I need to volunteer to practice in this small conversation. Who wants, who I, wants to practice? I really would like to try it. Okay, Isidro and... Isidro Me. and... Walter. Me. Walter. What? Yeah. Okay, okay, Walter. Okay, let's, do it, let's do it. Let's, let's do, do it. it. Let's do it. Walter, you are A, and Isidro, you are B at this time. Thank you. All right. You can start. Okay. <clears throat> what kind of party are you going to have? Are you going to have? Sorry. Oh, well, yeah. we're going to have a karaoke party. A what? We are going to have a karaoke party. A what? We are going to have a karaoke party. <laughs> Oh well, <laughs> we are gonna have a karaoke party. <laughs> a what? You know, <laughs> you you. you, you <laughs> <get a B. laughs> okay, okay. okay. You know, karaoke party. <laughs> the people stand up and sing songs. And the music is on a city and the world mm -hmm. are on the television. I see so much. I see so Mark like karaoke. He karaoke. loves it. He loves it. He loves it. He loves it. Okay. okay. Excellent. <laughs> that was great. Thank you. Uh, what? Um, patinavo, patinavo. <laughs> We will never forget this sentence, right? We will never forget about this sentence. We're going to have una lágrima por este <laughs> Okay, very good. I need other two volunteers. Anyone? Anyone wants to participate? Okay. If not, I'm going to choose Jonathan. You say. So, Jonathan Mike. and. Mike. Alexis. Jonathan and Alexis. Okay, thank you. Alexis, uh, can you please start? And Jonathan is B at this time. Okay. So, 
Okay. What kind of party are you going to have? Oh, we're, we're going to have a karaoke a karaoke party. A what? You can you can karaoke, reference song, or and sing song. The music is on a city on the works on the television, on the television. I see. So Mark like karaoke. He loves it. He loves it. Excellent. Very good job. It. <laughs> that was excellent. Just this word. How do you pronounce this word, guys? Kind. Yes. Kind. 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 What kind of? Kind. And how what do you kind? pronounce this one? Karaoke. Karaoke. Yes. Karaoke. 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 <laughs> okay. Excellent. Ah, karaoke. <laughs> ¿Cuántos ya se dieron cuenta que este es el listening in the midterm test? Ah, really? ¿No se dieron cuenta? This no. Is the yes. This, no. Is the, this is the listening part in the midterm exam. Ah. Uh, yes. <laughs> yes. One. My case. Okay. Question three. Special this weekend. Okay, now I have some question for you um, about the listening and this conversation practice. So what is a possible answer? If it is green, it's positive. If it is blue, it's negative answer. So what is a good answer for this question? Are you going to have a Christmas party? What is a good answer for this question? Yes, I am. Okay, excellent. Yes, I am. We are going to answer using the verb B. Yes, I am. Uh, the next one, it's a negative answer. And it says, is she going to buy present for her family? No, Which she's family? not. No, she's not. Okay, you say, no, she is not. In contract, I'll say, no, she isn't. No, she isn't. No, she isn't. The next one is, uh, let's see, affirmative answer. Are they going to go? to a birthday party? Yes, yes they, they are. are. Yes, yes, they, they are. are. Okay, we they answer are. using the verb yes, B. Yes, they are. Yes, they are, excellent. Yes, they are. Are, are we going to buy, I'm oh, sorry, is he going to decorate a Christmas tree? No, he isn't. No, he is. No, he isn't. No, he isn't. That is a good answer. No, he isn't. A negative yeah. answer. In the next one, are we going to buy firecrackers? Yes, we are. Yes, yes we, we are. are. Yes, we are. Yes, yes we are. Yes, Excuse me, are. teacher. What does mean fire firecrackers? What is? this? Ah. <laughs> are we going to buy firecrackers? Firecrackers. Okay. Oh, thank you. Firecrackers. Firecrackers. Crackers. Um, crackers. <laughs> Ah, por eso dicen pili crackers. Oh, yeah. pili crackers. Ah, like ah, ahora veo que no se okay. refiere a los pili crackers. Pili crackers. Mm -hmm. Is yeah. it going to be fun? Is it going to be fun? No, no, he is. No, it isn't. No, it isn't. It isn't. No, it isn't. No, it isn't. No, it isn't. No, it isn't. Okay. On the meter, uh, you found a. Uh, an exercise which is similar to this, right? Usted leía la pregunta y usted buscaba la respuesta, right? Yes. So, so there are the answers to the yeah. midterm. Yeah, so similar to this, right? All right. So not exactly this, but it's For similar. example, that, that are the sample. That, was that this. are some exactly example. Yeah, right, so let's see. Similar. Uh, let's practice this information question. What are you going to do next weekend? Any volunteer to answer this question? What are you going to do next weekend? What are you gonna to do? What are you gonna do next week? What are you gonna do next weekend? Any volunteer? To I'm gonna play. This I'm gonna play football. Uh, okay, I'm gonna play football. Yeah, soccer. it's a good answer. Yeah, you can say it's football or soccer. It's Saturday. On Saturday, I'm, very good. I'm gonna paint the, the house. I'm gonna paint the house. 
Okay, I'm gonna paint my house, so I'm gonna paint the house. Yeah. My house, yeah. Very good answer. Any other? Any other? What are you gonna do next weekend? Anyone? The last answer. What are you gonna do next weekend? I, I, my friends, I really would like to go to St. Michael City uh, to go to the uh, cathedral, cathedral St. Mike. Okay, I would like to San, go there. San Miguel Cathedral. San Miguel, San Miguel the, Cathedral. But in this case, it is not a plan, right? So, so we don't use going to because you say would. And that is a probability, right? Good. It's like, yo podría ir, ¿verdad? It's another time. Y so, si usted ya tiene el plan, ¿verdad? Y usted sí va a ir, entonces si utilizamos going to. Aquí okay. con el, el would es como un deseo. I would like to go to San Miguel Cathedral. Me gustaría. Me gustaría. Mm, OK, OK, OK. No aplica el would, I would like. Me es, gustaría. Es I'm going. La, I'm la, going. La, I'm la, going. La oración está bien, ¿verdad? It's ok. Una pero estamos expresando solo un deseo. ¿verdad? Un hecho. Vamos a expresar un hecho. Y cuando usamos el going to, es como un hecho, un plan. I'm going All to right. go to San Miguel Cathedral. Yo voy a ir. Voy. But very good. So, thank you very much. So, I'm going to go to the cajero automático. Okay. Automatic It's machine. <laughs> But yeah. it's empty. <laughs> automatic machine. Oh, okay. Automatic machine. I'm going to okay. go to the automatic machine. Then the next question, question, what are you going to do exercise? Why are you going to do exercise? It's asking for a reason. Why are you going to do exercise? I'm going to exercise for health. Okay. And you say because... I want to be healthy in this time. I want to be healthy. I want to be healthy, yes. Yeah. When are you going to celebrate your birthday? Where? It's asking for a place. So where are you going to celebrate your birthday? My house. Okay, okay. At, my, at my house, at the beach. Uh, restaurant. At a restaurant. At the... Disco. Okay, very good. Any other answer? Our restaurant. Okay, at our restaurant. Who? The next, the last question. Who? Who is asking for a person or people? Who are you going to wife. invite to your birthday party? With my wife. Celebrate. Okay, then you say, I'm, I'm going to invite my wife. I'm gonna yes, invite my wife. friends. I'm gonna invite my parents. I'm gonna invite my co-workers. So sister. again, I'm going to invite my sibling, my sister and my brother. So, good, good. So you are going to find this question too, right? On the midterm test. And these are called information questions. You Parientes. Yeah. How do you say parientes, familiares, relatives? Relatives. I'm going to invite all my relatives. Okay, excellent sentence. Thank you. I'm going to go with my wife. I'm going to invite my wife. Okay. Yeah. Okay, good. Excellent answer. Thank you. Then the T, we study these common illnesses. Do you remember some of them? You are going to find out on the midterm test too. Common illnesses. Illness, come on, illness. No. I don't I remember. remember. I don't remember. Oh illnesses. Oh, how are you? Do you remember do you all this question? How um, are you? How, how do, do you feel? What's going on? What's the yeah. matter? And then you say, I don't feel well. I don't feel what well. What I have that? a headache. Not so good. I have sore eyes. So if I ask you, how are you? What's of this answer? How are you? How are you? I'm good. Okay, I'm good. How do you good. feel? 
How do you feel tonight? I feel good. I feel well. I'm not so good. Okay, you say I'm not so good. So what's wrong? I have sore eyes. What's wrong? I have a headache. I have a headache. I have sore eyes. So very good. Now let's see. Uh, we also study some advices using imperative sentences. So if I have a headache, I take an aspirin. If I have a sore eyes, I put eye drops on my eyes. In some other advices, like don't watch TV. If you have a sore eyes, don't watch TV. Don't watch don't, TV. Don't touch your eyes. Don't touch your eyes. Your eyes too. An aspirin. So Take yeah. an aspirin. Okay, very good. So we studied this, right? Imperative sentences to give advices. Poor eyes uh, drop. Now this is the reading part. Do you have any question about this reading? Home remedies. You found this reading part on the meter exam too. Home remedies. I remember. I remember it. Okay, do you have any question about the vocabulary here? Is it easy or difficult? Everything is clear. Everything is clear. Okay, now let's yeah. see the home, home remedies. Do home remedies really work? What is your opinion? ¿De verdad funcionan los remedios caseros? Do home remedies really work? Yes. Yes, they, yes, they do or no, they don't. And why? Yes, they do. Really? Yes, I do. Yes, they do. Have you ever tried some of them? Uh, maybe because of the after in the past, uh, there don't exist the hospital. The people okay. uh, do remedies. Okay, See, the yes, people do rem right. the remedies at home. Okay, yeah, in the past, um, there weren't, and uh, let's see, um, how can I say this? Um, uh, medicine, uh, there wasn't medicine, so remedies were, uh, were useful, right, in the past. So you're right, and some of them really work. I think some of them really worked, even they are better than modern medicine, right? Yes. So many people say, yes, try these simple home remedies. Any volunteer to read the first paragraph tonight? A cold or a cold. ¿Qué remedios caseros son buenos para un resfriado? Thank you, you can read. You can start reading. Okay, a cold. What can you do for a cold? Many people eat hot chicken soup. Other people drink hot water with red pepper, sugar, lemon, juice, and milk. And milk. Pretty good. Okay, that was excellent. Thank you. So, chicken soup, hot chicken soup. Does it work chicken for a soap. cold? Does it work for a cold? Oh, yes, it is or no, it isn't. What do you think? A cough. No, it isn't. No, it isn't. Okay. Uh, other people drink hot water with red pepper, sugar, lemon juice, and milk. That's good. Uh, okay. Lemon, lemon juice. It's very good for a cold. Lemon juice. And let's see. Lemon any, juice. Any, it's good, the lemon. Any other lemon volunteer juice. to read the second paragraph? I'll let it. I'll let it. Any volunteer? They're not going to choose someone. It's time to the ladies. It's time okay. to the ladies. <laughs> okay, Isidro, choose one of your classmates. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to choose. Okay. My partner, uh, Morena, you can do okay. it. Thank you, Isidro. Morena, you can, can you? Can you, can you do it. So can you, in que, no agarre. <laughs> uh, you were going to read it, a cough. Can a you cough. read this paragraph, please? A cough. Lo leo. Yes, yes, please. Okay. Do you have a bad cough? 
a call. The, the variety or Thai song honey. Honey, honey. Honey, honey. Honey. This can make your strong feel bit bitter. Bear. No. Strong Bear. feel bear. Okay, excellent. Thank you, Morena. That was a great job. Es que la agarramos descuidada, descuidada, ¿verdad? <laughs> yes. Me Eso. falta, me sí, falta. No, por supuesto que... Okay. <laughs> okay. Don't worry, we are learning. We are learning. So every time you try it, uh, you are improving, right? You are learning, right? Uh, so continue doing in that way. So do you have a bad count? Drink warty or taste and honey. This can make your throat feel better. A headache. Any volunteer to read this paragraph? A headache. 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 Any volunteer? Then, my, my. Okay, I can, I can try it. Yes. Voluntary. La venganza, the revenge. Que se aprendo. Yes. No, pero bueno, con los errores aprendemos, no, porque hay unas palabras ahí, teacher, how do you say Cloth. Cloth. Yeah, let's see. Please, we get cloth. cloth. You can also put your hand in hard work. And which one? Cloth. Uh, what the about head? Ah, cold cloth. A yes. cold cloth. Un pedazo ah. de la okay, okay. Frío. Yes, cloth. yes, yes. Okay, okay. Okay. If you want, I can start. A headache. What about a headache? Put a cold cloth on your head. And splash your face with a cold water. You can also put your hand in hot water, and this can help. Thank you very much. Headache. 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 Okay. Headache. Okay. Headache. Que lo diga el estilo europeo. Okay. Headache. Okay. And the last one in Holland. Acento. 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 Headache. Let's see. How do you say, teacher? Headache. 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 Okay. Headache. Headache. Insomnia. Anyone here to read the last Headache. part? Headache. 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 Drink a large glass of warm milk or take a very warm bath. Excellent. Very good. If you very can't, warm, warm milk. If you can't sleep at night, drink a large glass of warm milk or take a very warm bath. So it's going to help you a lot. So very good. Question about the reading. No, Dicho, yo creo que en insomnia acá en nuestro país en El Salvador como que no mucho funciona eso es más americano que, que latino porque aquí por lo general nadie se toma un vaso grande de leche o... ¿verdad no, que no solo compañeros? Café, solo café pues ahí está aquí es al revés disfrazado una leche ahí en la botella de pizza Le, leche con, con ron <risa> Sí, chola. Un, un ponche, un ah, chola, una michelada. Un ponche con piquete. Sí, con este, no, este eh. remedio es más americano que, que latino. Ok. We are yeah, American. Right. Eh, no, aquí en Latinoamérica no ajusta para leche, solo para café, ¿verdad? Sí. Okay. Sí, 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 sí. Y, y Felipe tiene mm. técnicas, right? Teacher, pero aquí la única solución cuando alguien tiene insomnia es read a book. Oh, yeah, Agarre, right. Agarre un libro y, yeah, y inmediatamente yeah. está you're dormido. Right. Mm -hmm. Yes, you're right. Oh, oh, so. one beer. Sí o no, amigos. <laughs> one beer. Que se ponga okay. a ver tele también. Agarre el TikTok y amanece. Sí. Ok. Yes. That was the midterm feedback. So you found these exercises on yeah. your midterm exam. Todos los ejercicios que vimos estaban en su examen. If you have, if you still have any questions, you can write on the WhatsApp group. So I have a second topic for tonight in this thing that people have to do. Okay. We are going to study this, have, have to do. Have to do. So, ¿Cuáles son sus obligaciones en casa? Cosas que tiene que hacer, right? 
So okay. have, have at this time is a modal auxiliary. It's not the verb have, which means tener. It is the modal auxiliary had, which means the verb. Usted debe have to. Have to. Yeah. Have to, right? Have to use it. You have to when you think it's necessary to do something or you are obligated to do it. So it's necessary or you are obligated to do it. Let's see, for example, I have to do my homework. What is going to happen if you don't do your homework? Si usted no hace su tarea, ¿qué le va a suceder? A plaza. Probably, probably you, will <laughs> fail, you will fail the course, right? Uh, I have to work tomorrow. So you are obligated, right, to go to your work. Or you are obligated to work. I have to work oh. tomorrow. No option, right? She has, uh, she has to go to the dentist. She to to so the she dentist. is obligated or she is necessary that she go to the dentist. She has to go to the dentist. Ella debe ir al dentista. He has to clean the house. He has to clean the house, right? It's necessary to do it, or he is obligated to do it. So has. We are going to use have to plus a verb. I have to take a bath. I have to buy a cereal. I have to go to the school. So I have to. Y utilizamos have to con estos pronombres. I have, I have to, to go, I have to go to the supermarket. Yeah, right. I have to go shopping, you can say. I have to go to the supermarket. Okay. I have to I, go shopping. You have to, we have to, and they have to. Mm -hmm. With the third person, he, she, and it, we're going to use has okay. to. Has, has to. Yes. Has to. Pretty good. Pretty and good. And let's see, he has to. She has to, it has it to. It has to. Plus the verb, plus a verb. So look at this, I have to do my homework. It's an example. I have to work tomorrow. She has, she has to go to the dentist. He has to clean the house. Now let's see in the next. I have to do wash the dishes. I I have to do the dishes. I have to do the dishes or I have to wash the dishes. Yeah. Wash the dishes. So I have to paint. I had to paint. I have to wash the dishes. We also can use don't have to, right? Don't have to. I don't. I don't have to do it. Okay, excellent. So yo no tengo que hacerlo. I don't have yeah. to do it. Uh, let's say, for example, I don't have to go to school on Saturday. No es necesario, pero no está obligado a ir. So you say, I don't have to go to school on Saturday. You can do it virtual. Yes, they don't have to dance. Ellos no tienen que bailar. No es una obligación. They don't have to dance. En el caso de las terceras personas, we are going to use doesn't have. Okay. She doesn't have to go now. No tiene por qué irse en este momento. He has, oh she sorry, is, he, he doesn't have to clean the house. Él no tiene que limpiar la casa. It doesn't to be here. It doesn't to be here. Okay. He no tiene que estar acá. Okay. He doesn't well, have you are speaking about a thing. Well, you are speaking about a thing in the house or in the work. Yes, so look at these interrogative sentences. Do you have to work on Sunday? Utilizamos este, ¿verdad? Do you have to work on Sunday? So we are going to use this structure. Do because work. it's a question. Sometimes I have to do work. No. So in this question, uh, we're asking, uh, ¿Tienes tú que trabajar los domingos? ¿Estás obligado a trabajar los domingos? Do you have to work on Sunday? Say, yes, I do. No, I don't. An does affirmative she, scent or negative scent. Does she have to cook the dinner? Does she have to cook the dinner? Yes, she does. Yes, she, she does. does. No, she doesn't. No, she doesn't. Do they have to wash the car? Do they have to wash? They do. Yes, they do. Yes. No, no, they don't. No, they don't. Excellent. Does he have to wash his clothes? 
Does he have to wash his clothes? Does he have to wash his clothes? Yes, he does. He does. No, he doesn't. He doesn't. Okay, we're going to use this structure. Do, auxiliary do. Uh, noun, mm -hmm. a subject, noun, uh, have to, verb, and complement. Mm -hmm. And the question mark. Don't forget about the question mark. Teacher. Teacher, excuse me. Yes. Tell me. I really would like to, I really, I really would like to, to have clear what is the pronoun of ropa. Clothes. 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 Repeat it slowly, a little more slowly, please. Clothes. 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 Again. Uh, With F clove. at the end. Clothes. Clothes. Yeah. Don't forget about this sound. T each sound. Eh, recuerde que ese sonido se produce poniendo su lengua en medio de los clove. dientes. So you say clove. 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 Yes. Clove. Clove. Cloth. 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 Something like a F at the end. Cloth. Uh, cloth. Yeah, right. Cloth. So cloth. 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 I'm going, I'm going to share a video with the cloth. pronunciation. Cloth. So like, we are going to watch cloth. slowly. And also the position of the lips and the tongues and the teeth to pronounce this word. I'm going to share that oh, with you on the WhatsApp group. Really? Yeah, I'm, I'm going. Oh, to... really? Yeah. Okay. So, That's what good. Clothes. Thank you very much. Be Clothes. Before. Clothes. Then, let's go with this. Don't forget about this structure. Uh, uh, auxiliary <laughs> do. A subject have to the verb and the complement. If it is third person, does. Si es tercera persona, we're going to use does. Does he? Does she? Does subject have to the verb and complement. So we're going to study these exercises tomorrow. We're going to continue. Uh, teacher, excuse me. Uh, yes. An observation. Uh, when the answer is a, uh, when the sentence is an answer in the third person, does he have? There is not has. It has to be have. Does he have? Yes. Uh, because okay. The, because the third person is here in the auxiliary. When you make the yeah. question, the third person yeah. is here in the auxiliary. Okay. So yeah. does, you yeah. say does, okay. he have yeah. to. Eso lo convierte ya en, en have, porque yes. cuando por lo general es tercera persona, el singular es eh, he has, pero como ahí ya es una pregunta es, does she have? Yes. En, solo, va a ser has, solo va a ser has en oraciones afirmativas. Afirmativas, ok. Ah. Cuando es una pregunta, ya él va a have to. Have. Have to, y cuando es una oración negativa, igual, ¿verdad? Ya no utilizamos eh, has, because we say he doesn't have to. Entonces okay. aquí va la tercera persona en el auxiliar. Doesn't. He doesn't okay. have to. She okay. doesn't have to. He doesn't mm -hmm. have to. Yes. Ok, more, the last. More, gracias. The last things for tonight. Uh, this is the last exercise. And look at this. Top eight things people mm. hate to do. Is it true that people uh, hate to do these activities? Let's see the first one, stand in a line. Do you stand hate, in a line. Do you hate standing, standing in a line? I don't really like. Oh, you don't really like? No. Well, Alpha, do you like standing in a line? Standing in a line. Standing in a line. Look at the second, do laundry. Stand or line. wash your clothes. Mm. Do you hate your washing your clothes? I don't really like, and I never do it. Uh, what about number I three? Don't. Uh, you don't like. Uh, what about number three? Travel to work. Travel, travel to, work. to work. Do you hate traveling to work? Ah, because because something in El Salvador is a little uh, uh, dangerous. <laughs> oh, yeah, you're in right. The public transportation. Travel by bus, it's dangerous in El Salvador. Yes. 
Okay. Oh. Let's see number four. Go to meetings. I don't really like it's when you are sign. when you are looking for a work. Oh yeah, that's are an boring. You, you put you put so nervous. Yes, that is an interview, right? In this case, meeting is reunión. Mm -hmm. Exercise. Do you hate doing exercise? Mm. Yes, I do exercise. Oh, so. <laughs> okay, now let's see. Um, work in the yard. Some people don't like to work in the yard. No les gusta trabajar en el patio, right? No me gusta garden, tocar. Take care of the flowers sí. or the plants. Oh, My sure. wife. No, no me gusta tocar la tierra. Ah, okay. Cool. Hay, clean... hay, hay mucho gato por aquí. <laughs> <laughs> and clean the house. What about clean the house? Do you hate cleaning your house? Mm. I really Sunday. like to clean. I like, I mean, in my case, sí me gusta. Sunday. Especially uh, Sunday. Especially on Sundays. Very yeah. good. So now open the mail. Uh, it doesn't apply it right, right now. We don't open the mail. Right? Uh, we just read text. Solo leemos textos, ¿verdad? Un WhatsApp. Ay, no nos gusta porque puede messenger. venir una sorpresa, un cobro o algo ahí. No, no ah, nos gusta. Ah, okay. Some bills, right? <laughs> yeah. Bills. I don't really like. Okay, now let's see. Do you have any question? Any question, teacher? Everything is clear, teacher. Thank you very much. Okay. This weekend we we learned too much this weekend. Yes. Okay, so for proof, right? That you learn a lot during this session. Don't forget that if you have a topic that you want that we discuss here in the class about the course and you can tell me, right? And we are going to prepare that class and we're going to have that explanation, right? Uh, tonight, and let's see, I have a homework uh, to look for those sounds, right? Uh, what, what were the sounds? Where's Felipe? Felipe was saying the sounds, right? So I'm gonna look for that and we're going to study that class. Okay. So enjoy your weekend, right? Enjoy with your family, yes, and be careful. If you have some, sometimes uh, don't forget to work on the platform exercises. Si aún no ha tomado el examen de medio curso, you can do it, right? Right after the class, tomorrow, Saturday or Sunday, right? And we are going to start section number four the next week. So good night. Have a good night and see you next Sunday. Sunday, sorry, Monday. You are like your student. You are your like student. Okay. Los, los quiero tanto que los quiero ver hasta el domingo. Yes. <laughs> okay. I so wish. See you. Bye bye, partner. Take care, bye -bye. please. I'm trying to be happy. Bye. 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 Bye.